sad. William and Kate fell upon difficult times when Charles becomes king as divergent notions. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, and Prince William are set to hit a bump in the road when Prince Charles becomes king, relationship expert Neil Wilkie has claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, both 39, are understood to be being embroiled in a furious row with the BBC over a documentary this week. The Cambridges have reportedly snubbed the BBC over plans for the broadcaster to air their special Christmas carol concert next month. The event, which will be held at Westminster Abbey on December 14, is now set to be televised on ITV. It comes after the BBC's royal documentary, The Princes and the Press, aired on Monday this week. However, it drew a furious response from the Cambridges and other senior royals, who accused the BBC of propagating overblown and unfounded claims. The row is unusual for William and Kate, who usually steer clear of controversies compared to some other royals. Relationship expert Neil Wilkie has analysed the couple's relationship, tipping them for a bump in the road once Charles succeeds his mother, the Queen, as monarch. The expert claimed that Kate and William, who tied the knot in 2011, have been fairly plain sailing in their relationship so far. However, he said, the next bump in the road will be when Queen Elizabeth dies, and Charles becomes king. That's going to be the point at which William will have a clearer idea of how many years it's going to be before he becomes king. Charles is sometimes reported to want a slimmed down monarchy compared to the Queen and is said to be planning a major shake up of the royal family when he becomes king. Mr. Wilkie said, there'll be a change in the way in which the royalty governs the country because Charles has got different ideas to Queen Elizabeth. So, it'll be interesting to see whether King Charles just holds the fort for William or whether he tries to be the king that he's always wanted to be and maybe creates a more difficult handover for William. Charles has also been accused of shirking the royal family's convention to stay out of political matters. In the past he has lobbied the government on one of his favorite subjects, the environment, as well as on other issues, including the Iraq war and the availability of alternative medicines. Prince William and Kate Middleton reportedly have tension with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, who are currently living in California. There are reports that the Cambridges could visit the United States, but they could allegedly enter a lose-lose situation. In October, biographer Duncan Larkham speculated that William and Kate could have a tour in the United States in the near future. The couple previously visited the United States in 2011. A royal tour to the U.S. is long overdue, Larkham said, according to Closer. They are our most important allies and there is a huge appetite for the royals over there. Royal tours take around six months to plan in secret so it's likely there's one in the works to visit later this year or next, and my best bet is it will be William and Kate. Larkham added, it's part of their royal duties to visit the States, so they'll go at some point, whether it's next year or the near future. It should be noted that the Cambridges have not publicly commented on this speculation. Some royal experts have been commenting on a potential US tour for the Cambridges. Onlookers are also questioning whether William and Kate will visit Harry and Meghan in California. According to royal expert Jonathan Sacerdotti, if William and Kate stay at Harry and Meghan's house. It's like so many of these things, it's a sort of lose-lose situation, Sacerdotti told us weekly. If they get invited and they decline, it seems petty and nasty. And if they don't get invited, it seems petty and nasty from the other side. And if they do accept such an invitation and something goes terribly wrong, that seems like a bad idea. I can't quite see how this would work. According to Larkham, the Sussexes might not take well to the Cambridges visiting the United States. This is because Harry and Meghan are trying to establish a career in various American industries and appeal to the American public.